If you want to learn how to make this Dr. Seuss hat, keep on watching. So the first thing you do is you have to curl your strips or it's going to be super hard to work with. Then you fold this. I am working with a 110 pound cardstock, which you will see that I will struggle because it's very super thick. It's literally like cardboard. So it doesn't matter. It was on discount in Joann's and I was going to work with what I got. So just, you know, if you apply glue, you're going to have to apply a lot of pressure so it can work with you. If not, it will slip away, but that's okay. This glue lets you work with that. As you can see, I am gluing the combs under the base. And after you do that, the cones will be exposed under, but that's not a problem. Just go ahead and cut out a second base and glue that under and you won't see the cones anymore. You'll be doing the same technique for the lid. However, very, very important. Since this hat is not symmetrical, as in both sides are not the same, when you create the lid, it has to be flipped over. The file's already flipped over for you. However, don't be tricked by flipping it over again and making it the both same size. Because when you create the lid and you are done, you know, creating it like the base and you flip it over so it can close it won't close because now it's backwards if that makes any sense so make sure you have your instructions they come with your files they're in pdf and just have that handy and just make sure that you're following the instructions <laughs> the clear part make sure that you're not putting too much glue because when you put that clear part on top and you press down that glue will seep onto the plastic and you can erase it with a glue eraser however just put a little bit it goes a long ways I promise and then when you're doing the cover you need a precision glue um, I use barely arts that works the best for me and this glue is amazing it see how there's a little bit of white i don't worry about it because it will dry super super clear and thin versus the other one it is clear but it's super thick and you can see it and then i put weight on top of it and wait a couple minutes and then it's dry and see how it's flipped over and it closes perfectly now 
So now that that's dry, then I'll go ahead and glue these little white parts just to give it the whole full effect. And then other than that, if you have any questions, please send me a message.